Hi, so my name is Dan Linfoot. I race for Honda Racing British Superbike team with number four. So for 2016, simply the mission is to try and win the British Superbike Championship. Uh, I've been fifth for the last two seasons uh, consecutively. So yeah, one aim was is to improve upon my final finish in position of fifth. Uh, I want to achieve more podiums and I want to be in a stronger position for the showdown phase of the season at the, at the end of 2016. I think I can improve it myself in, in a few ways moving into 2016. I seem to be I seem to be a slow start over a race weekend, so Friday seems to be generally a struggle and then we seem to find some speed on Saturday and in particularly race better on Sunday. So one personal aim would be to try and improve Friday and Saturday and with a view of making Sunday even better again. Well, 2015 was, was marred with some ups and, well, with some downs, sorry, but also with, with quite a few uh, ups. We had four podiums and finished fifth overall, but also broke my wrist at the second round. So I'd say my highlight was probably coming back to strong uh, pace at the end of the season where I had two further podiums. Um, but obviously BSB is a strong series with many rivals who are all capable of podium finishes. So um, to even just be achieving podium finishes in this series is, you know, is something very worthwhile and I don't take for granted. So I want to have lots more of those this year. For sure the biggest downer of 2015 was breaking my wrist at the second round after achieving my first one, well, my first podium for Honda Racing at the, at the first race here at Donington Park. So to be going into round two on a high and then breaking my wrist was just a massive low and obviously then you start the, the phase of recovery and getting your mind on back riding a bike and even when you do come back to riding, your riding is nowhere near as good as it was before you had the injury. So for sure that was the biggest downer. but. I'm, gonna, I'm looking to have zero of that this year and, and keep consistent and keep strong and focused on achieving podiums regularly. For sure was here in 2009 when I was only young, I think I was 18, 19 at the time and I was racing the 600 class. I, I came into the pit lane and overshot the garage so I stood on the back brake and the rest uh, flew, threw me over the handlebars and you know it was an embarrassing scenario in pit lane but I must say I was young <laughs> maybe a bit stupid and I hope to have, uh, have grown up a little bit since then my favorite music is, is Coldplay I love listening to what Chris Martin does and, and the band it's uh, they're a mega group and every song that they bring out I love and I'm actually going to see him again this year in, in June so look forward to that but yeah they're probably my favorite artist To be honest, family time, back at home, um, I do some pit bike riding, a small sort of super motorbike, so I do a bit of that for fun just to keep riding a bike and then just training stuff with its gym running and rowing, anything really, but probably just family time and, and riding my, my training bikes. To be honest, not that many fans approach me at the moment, I don't think that many know about me, but um, no, generally it's just for signatures or for a small chat in passing or, you know, to ask about the last race or something like that. But. I enjoy speaking to the fans and sort of, you know, I need to get them on my side more as hopefully I'm, I've become more established in British Superbikes. So, yeah, I'll, I'll always have time for the fans here in the UK. Yeah.